hello and welcome to my youtube channel chemvis in this video we are going to discuss iupac naming of bridged bicyclic compounds we will start with the simplest bridged bicyclic compounds which are unsubstituted bridged bicyclic alkanes after that we will discuss about more complicated systems these are five simplest unsaturated bridged bicyclic alkanes this view is the side view if we view these molecules from the top then they will look like this we can draw a general structure for these molecules in side view like as and top view for the same molecule will look like this here these two carbons are called bridge head carbons these vertices represent ch2 x y and z are the number of ch2 these also represent number of carbon in the bridge chain also called bridge length now let's go through some rules which are specific for iupac naming of bridged bicyclic compounds the first is regarding numbering of parent carbon chain we should keep in mind the following points while numbering the parent carbon chain is start numbering from the bridge head carbon follow the longest possible path to reach the second bridge head carbon continue numbering following the second possible longest path to reach the first bridge head carbon then number the remaining carbon atoms in parent chain the presence of functional groups or substituents in a bicyclic compound doesn't affect the main rule of numbering they are considered only when two two paths are of same length the second point is regarding a structure of iupac name it consists of three parts substituents bicycle inside a square bracket x dot y dot z and name of parent hydrocarbon where x y and z are bridge length one thing which is to be noted here is that x is always greater than or equal to y which in turn is greater than or equal to c for better understanding let's go through examples compound 1 numbering will start from bridge head both the bridge heads are of the same type so one of the two bridge heads will get number 1 there are three one carbon bridges so we can follow any path clockwise or anti clockwise or bottom to top if we follow anti clockwise path then the numbering will be 1 2 3 4 4 the remaining carbon will get number 5 there are five carbons in the parent hydrocarbon so it will be named as pentane each bridge has one carbon so x is equal to y is equal to z is equal to 1 substituent there is no substituent as we know the iupac name is substituent bicyclo x dot y dot z and then parent hydrocarbon so the since there is no substituent and x is equal to y is equal to z is equal to 1 and parent hydrocarbon is pentane so the iupac name will become bicyclo 1.1.1 pentane compound 2 both the bridge heads are of same type label any one of them as number 1 there are two one carbon bridges and one two carbon bridge as we know while numbering 
we should follow the longest possible path to reach the second bridgehead. Anti-clockwise path will be correct path and numbering to reach the second bridgehead will be 2, 3 and 4 like this. Since the remaining two bridges are of same length, so we can follow either left to right or top bottom to top path to reach the second bridge head. So if you label this bridge head as 5, then the remaining carbon will get number 6. There are 6 carbons in the parent hydrocarbon, so it will be called hexane. There is one 2 carbon bridge and two 1 carbon bridges. So x is equal to 2 and y is equal to z is equal to 1 substituent. There is no substituent. As we know the IPC name is substituent bicyclo x dot y dot z and then parent hydrocarbon. Since there is no substituent x is equal to 2 and y is equal to z is equal to 1 and parent hydrocarbon is hexane so the IPAC name will become bicyclo 2.1.1 hexane. Compound 3 both the bridge heads are of same type label any one of them as number 1 there are two 2 carbon bridges and one 1 carbon bridge as we know, while numbering, we should follow the longest possible path to reach the second bridge head. Here, we can follow either clockwise or anti-clockwise path. If we follow clockwise path, then the numbering to reach the second bridge head will be 2, 3 and 4 like this. Since out of remaining two bridges, one has two carbon while other only one. So, the two carbon bridge will be numbered before the first, before the one carbon bridge. So, the numbering will be 5, 6 and 7 like this. There are 7 carbon atoms in parent hydrocarbon. So, it will be called as heptane. There are two, two carbon bridges and one, one carbon bridge. So, x is equal to y is equal to 2 and z is equal to 1 substituent there is no substituent as we know the ipc name is substituent bicyclo x dot y dot z and then parent hydrocarbon since there is no substituent x is equal to y is equal to 2 and z is equal to 1 and parent hydrocarbon is heptane so the ipc name will become bicyclo 2.2.1 heptane compound 4 both the bridge heads are of same type label any one of them as number 1 there are three bridges with two carbon each here we can follow any path for numbering so numbering will be 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 there are 8 carbon atoms in parent hydrocarbon. So, it will be called as octane. Here, x is equal to y is equal to z is equal to 2. Substituent. There is no substituent. IPSC name. Substituent bicyclo x, y, z parent hydrocarbon. Since there is no substituent, x is equal to y is equal to z is equal to 2. And parent hydrocarbon is octane. So the IPC name will become bicyclo 2.2.2 octane. Compound 5. Both the bridge heads are of same type. So we can label any one of them as number 1. There are 3 bridges with 3, 2 and 1 carbon atoms. We will follow the longest possible path to reach the second bridgehead. So the numbering will be clockwise like as 2, 3, 4 and 5. We will follow the second longest path to reach the first bridgehead. So 
the two carbon bridge will be numbered as 6 and 7. The remaining one carbon bridge will be numbered as 8. Parent hydrocarbon has 8 carbons in the chain. So, it will be called octane. Here, x is equal to 3, y is equal to 2 and z is equal to 1. Substituent. There is no substituent. IUPAC name consists of substituent bicyclo x dot y dot z and then parent hydrocarbon. So, it will be named as bicyclo 3.2.1 octane. Compound 6. Compound 6. There are 3 bridges with 3, 2 and 1 carbon atoms. There is a chlorous substituent in 2 carbon bridge. As we have already discussed that the substituent doesn't affect the bridge size priority. Here also 3 carbon bridge will be numbered first followed by 2 carbon bridge and then 1 carbon bridge. In this example the two bridge heads are not the same. So we have to be careful while numbering. If we give number 1 to the back side bridge head then the numbering will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8 like this. If we number front side bridge head as number 1 then the numbering will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8 like this. Since first numbering gives lower number to the substituted carbon, so it will be the correct numbering. Parent hydrocarbon is octane. Here x is equal to 3, y is equal to 2 and z is equal to 1. Substituent. 1 chloro at C6. IPSC name will be substituent bicyclo xyz and then parent hydrocarbon which will be 6 chloro bicyclo 3 to 1 octane compound 7 in this case too there are three bridges with 3 2 and 1 carbon atoms there are two substituents an ethyl group in one carbon bridge and a methyl group in two carbon bridge. Irrespective of substituents, here also three carbon bridge will be numbered first followed by two carbon bridge and then one carbon bridge. In this example also the two bridge heads are not of same type. So we have to be careful while numbering. If we number if we give number 1 to the back side bridge head, then numbering will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8 like this. If we number, if we give number 1 to the front side bridge head, then numbering will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8 like this. Here we can see that both the numbering give 8 number to the carbon bearing ethyl group while the numbering is starting from the front side bridge head gives lower number to the carbon bearing methyl group. So the numbering is starting from the front bridge head will be the correct numbering. Parent hydrocarbon is octane. X is equal to 3 y is equal to 2 and z is equal to 1 substituent an ethyl at c8 and a methyl at c6 ipc name will be substituents bicyclo x dot y dot c parent hydrocarbon which will be 8 ethyl 6 methyl bicyclo 3.2.1 octane Compound 8. Both the bridge heads are of same type. Label any one of them as number 1. 
there are two two carbon bridges and one one carbon bridge here the two carbon bridge will with alkene will be labeled first then the two carbon bridge without alkene so the numbering will be 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 like this there are seven carbon atoms in the parent hydrocarbon with double bond at C2 so the parent hydrocarbon will be called as hept2ene there is two two carbon bridge there are two two carbon bridges and one one carbon bridge so x is equal to y is equal to 2 and z is equal to 1 substituent there is no substituent as we know the ipsc name is substituent bicyclo x dot y dot c and parent hydrocarbon since there is no substituent and x is equal to y is equal to 2 and z is equal to 1 and parent hydrocarbon is hep 2 in so the IUPAC name of this molecule will become bicyclo 2.2.1 hep 2 in compound 9 both the bridge heads are of same type so we can label any one of them as number 1 there are three bridges with three two and one carbon atoms there is a double bond in two carbon bridge but still it will not change the numbering order that is we will first number the three carbon bridge followed by two carbon bridge and then one carbon bridge so the numbering will be clockwise like as two three four five six seven and eight parent hydrocarbon has eight carbon atoms in the chain with a double bond at c6 so it will be called as oct 6 in here x is equal to 3 y is equal to 2 and z is equal to 1 substituent there is no substituent ipsc name consists of substituents bicyclo x dot y dot c parent hydrocarbon so it will be named as bicyclo 3.2.1 oct 6 in the last example is the ipsc naming of compound 10 which is camphor here the bridge heads are different the methyl substituted bridge head will be will get number one there are two two carbon bridges and one one carbon bridge right side two carbon bridge has a keto group so it will be numbered first so the numbering will be two three four five six and seven like this parent compound is heptane to own here x is equal to y is equal to two and z is equal to one substituents there are three methyl groups one at c1 and two at c7 so they will be written as 177 trimethyl ipsc name will be 177 trimethyl bicyclo 2.2.1 heptane 2 own that's all in this video please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon if you like this video thank you very much for watching this video